guys welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome so today uh, I'm going to be talking about the elephants in the world or rather the elephants in the room or in the world and that is coronavirus there's a lot of misconception people are getting scared there's a lot going on right now and it's good to understand exactly what coronavirus is and how to stay safe in this period everybody's panicking a lot of people are panicking today i went to the store to get tissue paper and i went to four stores and i didn't get any tissue paper it was something else so guys it's important to stay safe so what is coronavirus coronavirus is not something new coronavirus is like common flu um the flu normal flu we have sars that happened in asia in 2003 is also a coronavirus and so is mers mers is a middle east respiratory syndrome and that's also a coronavirus. So coronavirus is a broad name for a zoonotic. That's um, a kind of disease that is transferred between animal and man. But why is this particular virus, this one, this one that is trending now, that's COVID-19, why, why is it so alarming? Why are we scared? What is going on? So the issue is, first, COVID-19 is new. You, you hear some people call it um, novel, novel COVID-19, novel disease, new co coronavirus. Yes, it was only detected in 2019. And why it is so alarming is because it has not been previously identified in human. It was only seen in animals. So that's why it's kind of alarming and that's why majority are scared so now presently the uh, mortality rate is 3.7 percent yeah it's 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 a bit scary and i understand that a lot is going on and people don't know what to do so first what are the symptoms the symptoms are fever cough shortness of breath breathing difficulties generally and it, that could progress from there to pneumonia and a lot of other things and uh the virus that is actually causing it before i forget that the virus causing it is called sars cov 2 but why um the who and the world at large is not using that name is because we don't want it to be um to be mistaken for the sars of 2003 like i earlier said so they are genetically alike so hence the name so we know the disease, we know the virus. People with underlying medical condition and uh, immunocompromised people like the elderly and uh, cytokine storm has been like the major cause of death. The containment phase of dealing with the disease has actually failed. But did not work so now we have moved to the delayed phase so what does that mean with that bottle what does it mean and it, that means that you should uh this is the phase where you have to self-isolate you hear people saying self-isolate self-isolate right now if you know you have a new cough or you have fever or you have recently traveled to any of the affected uh countries i think almost every country is affected right now if, if you have been in contact with anyone who has been diagnosed with COVID-19 and you're having symptoms, the best thing to do now is to save yourself and to help other people as well, especially the immunocompromised, is to self-isolate. How to stay safe in this period? First, don't panic. Do not panic. Guys, stop buying all the tissues in the mall. It's not funny. Stop taking all the bottled waters. Stop robbing people. It's, it's stop mugging people. It's not fair let us calm down there's no need to panic right now i understand the human response in this kind of scenario but then we need to calm down guys we need to wash our hands regularly regular copious washing of hands we can't over emphasize this with soap and water and sanitizers alone will not do it wash your hands wash your hands with soap and water it is very important in this period and as much as possible avoid social contact avoid social contact as much as you can self-isolate if you can avoid social contact no need for unshaking in this season it is totally okay not to shake people most importantly guys let us show love to one another in this trying time. Let's not be racist. Let's be our brother's keeper. And majority 
uh, because you are LD does not mean if you have it you recover and you could recover but then what of those you're putting at risk like those that are immunocompromised think of other people at this period guys let us stay safe and let us show love and to everyone who has lost someone in this trying time i pray the lord would console you and to all the departed souls may your soul rest in perfect peace thank you guys for watching and please subscribe to my channel i got loads of stuff for you guys and i'm sure covid19 is gonna be gone very very soon so guys stay safe out there show love bye guys